here. So yes, I am in a dress. I'm getting ready for a dinner party. Uh, but wait, before I show you the recipe that we're about to get into, I want you to see the back of my dress. It's a heart. It is Jacqueline's dress, my little sister, and I stole it from her. She got it in Australia, and the Australian fashion is just so cute. Anyway, so I'm so late for this dinner party and I have to make an appetizer. So what do I do? I head to Trader Joe's and I buy some really quick, fresh, easy ingredients to make a spinach cranberry salad. If you haven't had the salad before, OG, you need to try it right now. Go ahead and watch this video because it is sweet, it is salty, and it is just so savory and yummy. So if you're ready, come on, I'll show you how to make it. Grab that fresh baby spinach. Make sure you wash it thoroughly because I remember this one time in college when there was a caterpillar crawling in the salad bar. That was nasty. Then add a generous handful of dried cranberries to the mix. These are orange flavored, but it doesn't matter. You can go with regular craisins. I really love it because it adds a chewy, sweet texture to the salad. My go-to nuts are raw almonds. I've seen a lot of people add pecans or walnuts, but really you can choose whatever nut that you like to add that crunchiness. Next we add chèvre, which is a type of French cheese, a goat cheese. And I'm having a lot of trouble being spinach. Come on, squeeze the ass, let's pull it open. Ah, there we go. It's so fun to cut cheese, except when it sticks to your knife and you can't get it off. And now we top it all off with Marie's Raspberry Vinaigrette. I got this at Smart and Final, but you can also find a version of it at Trader Joe's. This is truly what sets the tone for the whole presentation of the salad. And there she is, a culinary beauty created in less than five minutes. It's time to eat. Whew, okay, we're done. So let's give it a bite before I go just to make sure it's good. Mmm. Not in our wretched. Mmm. I'm sure the guests will really, really like this. So guys, let me know in the comments below when and if you try this recipe and which kinds of salads you want to see me make next. Also, I just wanted to say if you saw this uh, wine bottle in the back and you have any questions about drinking, actually the truth is I don't drink and when the party host asked me to bring some wine to dinner today, I kind of freaked out and so I talked to the Trader Joe's guy for a long time. I was like, um, I got invited to dinner party and I don't know what to bring and he was like, well, what are they serving? Do you want red or white? And I was like, I have no idea. And so he suggested this Pinot Noir thing and so hopefully they like it. I don't drink just because I'm actually kind of allergic to alcohol, not just Asian glow, but seriously, when I drink, I'm like an upside down thermometer so I look horrible and I feel extremely sick. So anyway, I am bringing this for the party guests, but hopefully they enjoy my salad a lot more. So guys, I'll see you next time and I love you so much. Bye!